Welcome to Arcus, a wildlife rescue and rehabilitation center located in the Guatemalan rainforest along Lake Pekin Itza. Every year, Arcus receives hundreds of animals that have been confiscated from the black market by the Guatemalan government. Rehabilitating an animal stolen from its natural habitat can take up to a decade of care, retraining, and constant reevaluation. Those who maintain their natural instincts are eventually released into protected habitats, and those who cannot survive in the wild will remain in captivity lifelong. That's where volunteers and students like me come in. We lived and worked at the rescue center full time, going to sleep listening to the calls of the wild howler monkeys and waking up to the hungry squawking of the captive macaws. I work daily amongst scarlet macaws, toucans, crocodiles, turtles, and even a tamandua, the tree-dwelling lesser anteater. The numerous other species in our collective care were assigned to other students or staff, and I unfortunately did not receive as much exposure to them. We had alternating days of classroom lessons and practicals, including hands-on work with reptiles, birds, monkeys, and small mammals, as well as necropsy and clinic days where we had the opportunity to work closely with Dr. Morales and the other staff and focus on medicine. These are my favorite days, and I wish there are more of them incorporated into the program. I absolutely loved practicing my Spanish when speaking with the staff, having the opportunity to soak in their expert animal knowledge and to learn about cultural foods and traditions. We often went by boat into the nearby town of Flores and visited Tikal National Park on the weekend, Guatemala's most famous cultural and natural preserve. Wildlife medicine is about more than just being inside of the clinic. It is about learning to recognize behaviors. As someone who has never been close to these species, let alone handled them, these experiences were an amazing introduction to the world of exotic wildlife. Arcus's education center is separate and open to the public. Non-releasable animals help educate the community on the tragedies of the illegal wildlife trade and the impact that even one individual can have on the larger population. Prior to coming to Arcus, I did not truly understand the horrifying realities of the black market and the years of struggle involved in rehabilitation. Through this program, I have made some lifelong friends, many unforgettable memories, and I've gained a better understanding of the world as we live it.